Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. So if you don't know, we are in New York. We're gonna be here for a while. And we kind of went on a little shopping spree in the city. Um, yes. This is our first one since we've been here, probably our last one. I'm really not doing a whole lot this time, but we got a lot of great stuff from different stores. So before we get started, if you are not subscribed, please subscribe to our channel. We try to upload every Tuesday and Friday at 9.30 a.m. This video is a little late because we did have some issues with lighting. So this is actually like our fourth attempt filming this video yeah. but um so this, this is right. up sorry so this is up on saturday instead but anyways you guys get it you're still getting a video on tuesday so yes yes um okay so i think we should just get started we went to urban outfitters and we went to zara um probably like our two favorite stores yeah. to shop at let's just start with urban outfitters first we have these oh, yeah. shirts by champion um I love Champion and I know that like at one point they were sold at Walmart and they were super cheap and something that was so cheap is now sold for like $70 yeah. in Urban Outfitters. But anyways, I really um, wanted it. I have a Champion hoodie um, from Scissors Concert, the Control Tour and um, so comfortable. Like it's so comfortable. It's, it's like my yeah. everyday um, outfits with leggings i love that so i kind of fell in love with how comfortable champion sweatshirts and hoodies are so i had to just get them all i mean i don't have them all but i need to expand my champion collection so i wanted to get some more and they're just so comfortable perfect for the airport perfect for just running errands perfect for like wearing actual real clothes in the house and you really don't want to got this one this is just like a pastel Pastel yellow. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, and it just has the champion logo in white with the red, of course. And this was $55 from Urban Outfitters. And this one is like a really cute blush pink champion hoodie. It's just champion products. Um, how much is this? I think the same price. I kept the tag on for this video. This one was $59. 15 so. You gotta put my tags back. They're very pricey for what yeah. it is, but they're such great quality. And they're really comfortable and I felt like they're worth it, so I really like them. Next from Urban Outfitters are these jeans. These are the mom high-rise jeans. I really love jeans and I really did want some mom jeans that were kind of baggy and I could cuff them. And these jeans, they fit so they do. perfectly. Usually my problem with the jeans are that they fit good down here because I've got pretty thick thighs, but the waist is always way too big. These jeans were made, I guess, for like an hourglass shape because this waist is so tiny, but everything else is big. So this stays up on its own. It's a pretty great fit. You don't even need a belt with these kind of jeans. That's what I love. So, and the wash is really nice. Yeah, and it's a little distressed. It has some rips. But the length is really nice for our height, right? For shorts. And the, um, it's high waisted, so you yeah. can wear it with like a cute crop top or something. They're so cute. I think they're just like the most perfect jeans. I wanted these so badly. These are $59. That's the most I've ever spent on a pair of jeans, but I feel like jeans last forever. So if yes. you find a pair that really fits you, that is, um, good that quality. really fits you, that is great quality, it's a good buy. These are gonna last me forever. I'm always gonna wear these. So it's worth that $59, I believe so. Okay, next we have two t-shirts because I'm kind of obsessed with like that t-shirt trend. Um, Gucci is doing it a lot where they just wear like a t-shirt and then like a really nice um, pleated skirt, like a long one that's a little um, holographic, if you will. But um, yeah, I just, I went into the men's section because you know, the men's section has like the best stuff sometimes, like, especially in urban. Yeah, if you're looking for um, like hoodies or t-shirts because the style is similar, you know? So Especially um, Champion products too, like Champion brand. I go into the men's section a lot because they have like really nice coral ones. They have funky colors that the girls section doesn't really have. And the so. girls section sells out fast. The boys section doesn't. Um, okay, so I just got these like t-shirts in size small because you know in the men's section you always gotta scale back on the size. This is Urban Outfitters brand, Artist Editions, and it's just a t-shirt. This one has like a cactus with some waves and a sun. It's like very abstract, abstract design. Art, yes. And then I got another one, 
same concept kind of um, same abstract design with a yellow sun and like a pine tree with a forest these were each $30 I think they would just be so cute tucked in with maybe some mom jeans you know it's just yeah. very like a, a really chill relaxed vibe and last but not least we got a pair of sneakers now being that we are kind of living in New York now I need comfortable shoes yes so I needed to get because I already have a pair of like Nike Rochers and I really do love them but I don't want to wear them every single day and we're really not a huge we're not huge sneaker people like we really yeah. are not huge fans of sneakers at all but we're here now and you do a lot of walking in New York it's called being so, practical so we needed ooh, they're orthopedic ortholite that's what I'm talking about um adidas I think what are they called? Adidas tubular shadow sneakers. Um, they're very like Yeezy inspired. Yes. With the whole trim on the bottom and then this part on the back and then the fabric. I like that style. And this color is something that I don't have. I mean, I only have one other pair of sneakers, but um, yeah, I really like the color. It's like a neutral color and then mixed with the gray. And it's just nice and they fit really well and they're super comfortable. Adidas is a good brand. I think these are $60. They were on sale. They were yeah. originally $100. $100. So that's also a really good deal. I know I needed sneakers. So that was like one of the main items on the list. So when I went there, so to be able to find a cute pair that looks good on sale, perfect. Okay, next we have Zara. We got a cute little um, haul from Zara. So first up from Zara is this really cute little mini skirt. It's I'm kind of loving skirts right now. I also have like a denim pair like this, not from Zara, but it has the same concept where it's like a little mini skirt with the buttons down the front. I think it's really cute. This is in black. Um, this was $35.90. And yeah, I'm kind of really excited to style this. I think it's gonna be really cute with maybe like a plain t-shirt mm -hmm. or you could even dress it up a little bit more with something a little bit more fancy. Button down. Yes. So next we have this yellow pleated skirt. I know it's kind of hard to see in this frame. I'll put a picture of the model wearing it on the website if I can find it on the Zara website. But um, I, this was actually, I didn't mean to buy this. I think I gave it to the guy to um, put back and he rung it up and I wasn't paying attention so that's my fault but um, I don't know I still like it so I'm gonna try it on to see if it fits me if not I'll return it um, this was $50 so I better like it um, but yeah I love the color yellow I thought it was a really nice skirt and again following that whole Gucci trends where they did like the big pleated skirts with like a t-shirt, I thought those would look good, you know, maybe with the yellow sun in the pine tree shirt that I just showed you from oh, yeah. Urban Outfitters. Okay, next up, I'm super excited about these pants. These are like some really loose, flowy pants. Um, they're a little cuffed on the bottom and they have a drawstring belt on top and they're also just stretchy and they're a little pleated. I love pants like this and I don't have a white pair and I think it's just gonna be so cute for the summer maybe even the spring I'm just really excited about these I hope they fit nice because they look a little big but the good thing about it is you could even tighten it with the string on the front belt so it should it should work out I'm really excited about these these were $39.90. So next we have um, another pair of pants, almost like the same concept. They have the stretch waist with the belt, um, like that paper bag kind of look. Um, the bottom is probably my favorite part because it's just very straight. They don't contour at all, like it's just straight down wide your leg. leg. Yeah, it's wide legs. I love how and the belt is not this fabric and it's actually a pattern yeah so it has different. a little like dimension to it this was 45.90 okay so speaking of basic t-shirts <laughs> we found this and we thought it was super cute it's this white basic t-shirt because that's what it is i love t-shirts with just prints simple prints or simple words or inspirational words this was 17.90 and then next i found another basic shirt this is in black and it just has uh quotes on it, it says new habits 
approach to life, find the opportunities hidden in each day. So this was $17.90, really cute basic top just to wear like with some jeans or like a nice printed skirt or something. Okay guys, that is it for a haul from Urban Outfitters and Zara. Um, I think that we picked up some pretty practical items, items that, you know, we didn't buy any heels, uh, is basically what I'm saying, which I always tend to do, but as you know, in New York, they're not very practical. We bought some sensible things that we yes. were actually gonna use here, that we actually need here, so I think that's good. So that is it, thank you guys so much for watching. We know you guys love when we do hauls, making hauls, clothing yes. hauls, so be on the lookout for some future lookbooks as well with these items. Um, that is it for today guys. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out our description box where we have all our social media handles so you can get some more behind the scenes and some more inside looks into our real life. And um, thank you guys so much for watching. We will see you next time. Bye!